What's up, street team? It's your boy, No Fame, letting you know that you can still rep his name even while you game. And I am here with a tip video, a help video, instead of a gameplay video. Now, this one was birthed out of what I found and what I had trouble with. So I want to put this thing out there to you guys because everywhere I look to try and solve this issue, couldn't find it. Okay, so I'm here today and I'm gonna help you out. If this helps you out, man, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for more tips, tricks, gameplay, a lot of fun having. And if you got the time, go ahead and check me out every Friday and Saturday on No Fame Gaming on Facebook Gaming. It's when I stream at 10.30 p.m. So go ahead and check your boy out. All right, now to the information. Now, this weekend, I did a couple things, man. I upgraded my monitor, which you know if you was on the stream, you heard about it. Upgraded my monitor so that way I can get the full, you know, I'll get some 120 FPS while playing Warzone. That way I could die two times faster. You know what I'm saying? At any rate, I went ahead and did that. And what I found out was that I had an issue because the Elgato HD 60S that I had, it only allows 60 hertz pass through, which means is rendering my, my monitor kind of useless because I couldn't play it at the same rate that I wanted to. So that means I had to upgrade my capture card. And what I did was I went out and got this thing. This 4K60 Pro, this thing uh, will go all the way up, obviously, to 4K, I think, at uh, 60 FPS. But we're not worried about that right now. Call of Duty Service is not playing in that. Um, certainly not Warzone. It's still a PS4 edition. But I went ahead and did that to upgrade it so that way the pass-through could allow me to play in 120. And it was phenomenal. It's been fun. But I'm going to tell you, man, I had a hard time getting that thing set up because they have different software that you got to add on once you get the 4K60 Pro. So with that thing, um, I had to upgrade that and I had to look and I scoured the internet to try and figure out what was going on because I couldn't get audio to pass through the system without me doing some type of work around. It was crazy. I mean, I, I took my computer apart to make sure it was the line was correct because, you know, I built my own PC. I, 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 I looked at the websites. I went to Elgato's, you know, frequently asked questions, but nobody had this solution. And I'm going to tell you, it wasn't until I called, shout out to the homie Chris at Elgato for helping me out, customer service, man. Listen, man, you get all five stars from me, buddy. So this is what you got to do in order to do it. Once you get it put in there, um, you'll see a lot of sites that'll tell you this too, that when you add it on the old HD60S, you know that what you have to do is you have to go into the game capture. Then you have to look at where it says analog and you have to select that because the PS5 and the PS4, they don't allow you to get all of the sound through there, including the chat. So you got to say it's separated and that's why you got to use the chat link cable. The problem is this. So when you got the chat link cable, um, let's go ahead Take a look at Elgato. So when you got the check link cable, you can see here that it's playing sounds. I'll go ahead and mute it. That is playing sounds from the thing. You can see it working right there on the, on the bar. And the problem is if I take, once I take this cable right here, the chat link cable and plug it in there, you get nothing. The bar goes away. The sound goes away and you got nothing. Well, I got the solution for you. So we'll go ahead and take that out. You hear the sounds and what you had to do in order to get it playing, you had to go to this. You had to hit the plus. And when you do the plus, even though you've changed it. So first, I'm sorry, let's go here. First, you have to go here. And when you go down to audio output mode, you want to go use custom audio device and then line in because Obviously, the instructions tell you you got to put the chat link cable in, you know, in your line in button. All right. In your line in slot. And then when you hit that, what you also need. I'm going to show it to you on here. You got to hit audio input capture. I know some of you guys may be like, well, duh, but listen, this is not out there. They don't tell you it. Um, I guess you're just supposed to know it. But if you don't. If you're, you know, beginning budding streamer, you don't have all this information, you know, we go to find things. And I want to make sure that somebody else doesn't have to go through it, that when you search this thing, you could find it. You hit the audio input capture. I've already got it existing there. So if I hit this, if I said, OK, um, now it's in there. And when I when I when I put in. When I put in the chat link cable, you'll be able to hear. Boom. Now you can hear. The PS5 sounds. It's just that simple, but it's not out there. So 
I want to do what I said I do, man. Help people out, man, so that way you ain't got to struggle like I struggle. All right? Now, listen, if you if you enjoyed that, if that helped you out, if you know somebody that helps out, go ahead and share it to them. If it helps you out, hit that thumbs up button. Go ahead and subscribe if you're not. It's absolutely free. It doesn't cost you a thing. And if you got a chance, come check me out on Fridays and Saturdays at 10.30 p.m. No Fame Gaming under Facebook Gaming. All right? It's your boy, No Fame, and I'll holler back.